Good morning, everybody. It's another one of these early days. It's before 6 a.m. or it's right at 6 a.m. now. Um, there is, um, I got to work today. So somebody dropped their phone last night uh, over there. They got a hold of me. So I got to come and get their phone for them uh, so that I can, I, gotta, I can't even talk. It's too early. All right. I think that's them in the parking lot over there. So I'm going to get suited up. See you guys in the water. Look at that tiny little boat. That thing is cute. Holy cow. Look at that thing. It's like 12 feet long. <laughs> All right, so they were just sitting on the bench. And really, unfortunately, it's exactly the same as the other phone. Just went right through the little crack right here. That's it. So basically, whoops. Uh, why is the light on? Doesn't matter. Okay, so it's going to be in between those framework. I wonder if I could just walk out in my dry suit. That looks so shallow. I actually think, but I can't see their phone though. That's the only thing. Oh wait, no, no. God damn it. What color is your phone? Uh, black color. Of course it is, yeah. Shall I dial it? Are you, are you dialing it? Yes. No, it's no. Okay. Yeah, the battery could be dead, right? Uh, what? The battery could be dead. Yeah, battery could be dead. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, you know what? I think I'm just gonna walk into the water. Hey, that's gonna be a first. I'm just gonna walk into the water. I think it's in like a foot of water right now. <laughs> Alrighty, so here's the plan from this uh, surface or from the dock when I was looking down with my little flashlight. It really looked like the water is only about a foot deep, so the plan is just to wade into the water just with my dry suit, uh, no fins, and no scuba tank. And as you can see here, I'm just walking, and it's already waist deep, um, and now it's like upper chest deep. This is apparently a really bad plan. So, but uh, luckily as I walked underneath the position where the phone dropped, here I am pointing to where the bench is that they were sitting at and where the phone went in. Um, this, I actually skipped forward a bit. I had to go back and actually get my fins because um, it was just so awkward to do this without any kind of means of propulsion. So fins on, no weight belt, um, just trying to feel around and I literally the bottom is just at my fingertip I could touch the bottom with my fingertip but I'm unable to to put my hand on the bottom and search properly even with my fins on because there's just so much air in my dry suit okie dokie so I had to go back and put my scuba suit on oh, oh my god this is so annoying I had to go back and get my scuba gear on of course now it's just a matter of breathing out and going into full scuba mode laying on the bottom in pitch black water because what you see is more than what I can see because <laughs> the GoPro actually does adjust for lightning. Um, so I'm, I'm actually just in complete pitch black here even with the light on. So all I'm doing is I'm just laying down on the bottom feeling around to my left, feeling around to my right. Uh, in real time just took approximately one minute, about 60 seconds or so. and. Uh, I'm feeling for the artificial shape of a phone. Obviously, I'm finding lots of uh, sticks and so on. And there it is. There's the phone. It took me a little while to find it. This dive was, uh, or so-called dive, was uh, a little bit annoying for me because I had to do three attempts. I sat, walked in with no fins, no scuba tank, and then I had to go back and get my fins, walk in, and then still couldn't find it. And then I had to, for the third time, I had to go put my scuba gear on so I could actually lay on the bottom and feel for the phone. Uh, so inefficient okay so there's the phone they didn't want to be on video so we're going to respect that so that's the phone in great condition i'm absolutely positive it's fine the battery's just dead look at that gorgeous sun behind me holy cow 
that's the smoke as well too anyway uh, another su- successful phone recovery as I say kids hang on to the phone when you're around water and again this is the same as the phone recovery and I'll put the link of the video at the end of the video um, same as they were just sitting on the bench it wasn't even like they were I mean they were on top of water but the phone just slipped right between the cracks man what are the chances anyway thank you so much for my patreon supporters we'll see you guys in the next one Thank you.